Damn, that intro is still badass, no matter how many times I watch it. <laughs> again, I said it before, I will say it again. I love the damn intro. Yep, I agree with you there, Scar. Hello everyone, this is Spirit Rosewolf, back for another session of Dynasty Warriors 9. So today, we are going to start back from where we left off in Chapter 4. The Man Who Ruled the Plains. As the character we've been playing through these entire sessions, Shaho Yuan. Right, so... Yeah, I'm just gonna choose resume game from here. I'm your biggest fan here. Yeah, I can see that, Scar. I can see that. <laughs> Just gotta deal with these long low times. Yeah, well, to be fair, I guess they're long because they're basically loading the entire open world instead of just one map. Five hours later, yeah. <laughs> After rescuing the Emperor from Shun An, Cao Cao leads him to his own capital of Shu Cheng. His control of the revered Emperor of the long reigning Han Dynasty gives him a certain prestige. Elsewhere, Yuan Shu's faction is gradually losing support. Panicking, he does the unthinkable. He declares himself emperor, basing his claim on the imperial seal he had taken from the late Sun Jian. Oh, well, he claims I guess we now know that Sun Jian's dead. He calls on all faithful lords to support him. Is that really However, a spoiler? This eh. gives Yuan Shao the perfect excuse against him. Shao proclaims Shu a traitor and begins his own campaign against him. Hey there, it's Miles. I won't be able to stay for too long. Oh, it's okay, Miles. It's okay, Edgy. I'm glad you were able to make it to one of these, at least. Okay, so we left off at a point where we were heading straight to a mission. Rescue at Wong Castle. Ooh, it's this one. Hmm. Now, this is mostly a... Cao Cao and Dion Wei centric mission, so I'm wondering how exactly the game is going to deal with it since we're playing as Shaho Yuan, a character who, as far to my knowledge, uh, doesn't really have much to do with this particular mission. By the way, there's only one way to find out. Master Shao Odun! But pardon my interruption. We've just received a request for immediate reinforcements. Oh, we're already getting into it. Unit. What did you say? We didn't even get any sort of introduction. Yes, I believe Master Cao Ung and Master Cao Unmi were on patrol in the vicinity of Wen Castle. Lord Cao Cao and Dion Wei are inside Wen Castle. What's going on in there? I'm worried about them. I hope they didn't eat too much. And now we have received a request for reinforcements at Wen Castle? This means that Zhang Xu surrender is... Assemble the troops at once! Is we what? Is what? Castle. Finish your sentence, school Jia. That voice, yeah. <laughs> It's surprising Shu Shu's voice is the only one that actually sounds like it's uh, original. God, he's the one who actually said that terrible line back uh, in like Dynasty Wars 5. <laughs> oh, we didn't even get to do the mission. It just straight up happened. Well, anyway, if you're playing at South Sour Dion Way, you basically have to escape Yuan Castle. 
And then this happens. No! Dwayne the Rock Johnson! He should be dead. He should be dead. He seriously should be dead by now. Yes, and he should be dead at this point. Like, seriously. He's a literal porcupine at this point. His flesh is made of steel. You're all right. Forgive me. I took Jung Chiu's surrender at his word, but it was merely a ploy devised by his strategist, Jia Xu. Ah, that Jia Xu. Dian Wei took it upon himself to hold off the enemies in the castle so that I could escape. He was already badly injured when I left. In fact, it may be too late to save him. However, I still have to try. I understand. Let's make our way to the castle as quickly as possible. Please wait a moment. We are facing a strategist who managed to catch even Master Cao Cao off guard with his trap. It is dangerous to simply rush in there. Ah, Gojia, always the voice of reason. Well, he is a strategist after all. And prepared another trap in response. In that case, how can we save Master Tian Wei? How can we? I don't think we can at this point. Attention and use that opportunity to see what they're planning. I wonder what the enemy strategist is up to. If we can learn the overall framework, we'll know how to make our move. Very well. I shall leave the details to you, Guo Xia. Everybody, we must hurry to Wen Castle. And he's not kidding about hurrying to Wen Castle, because we're technically we on a timed mission here. To draw the enemy in. Meanwhile, I will use that time to suss out their strategy. Sus. <laughs> so this strategist is the one that gave Master Cao Cao such trouble. I am looking forward to turning the tables on him. So yes, uh, like Cao Cao said, we are actually in a hurry here. Because <laughs> contrary to what the cutscenes show, Dian Wei is actually still alive. Yes, he's still in Wan Castle fighting it out with... Uh, who was it right there? Huchir. Yeah, there's Huchir right there. We also have Guo uh, Jia Xu and Zhang Xu as our main objectives, our main targets to get to. So we're basically timed to base to uh, save Dian Wei by going to this mission. If we take too much time, he'll die and we'll basically get a game over. Even though he's, uh, spoilers, he's supposed to die in this battle. So, why we can't just let him... Oh, the, 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 Dynasty Wars 9. <laughs> that's that's all I have to say. All right, so let us see what we can do to make this level 36 mission a little easier. We are right here, and the closest mission we have is a diversity tactic. Uh, complete this mission allows Guo Jia's plan to proceed. Defeat Zhang Jian. Now that is our mission objective, so let's go straight to it. It don't make sense. Yeah, Dynasty Warriors is pretty wacky. All right. I need the day when it starts to make sense is the day it stops being fun. Damn, you can definitely tell Sao Sao is serious about this. Well, it is Dion Wei. One of Sao Sao's favorite officers at this point in time. Okay, boys. <laughs> Damn it, that voice always cracks me up. Our target is 
with that parcel of land. Prepare to move. What the? What the? What the? Uh, why am I? What? Why was I stuck like that? We are a decoy unit. We need to fight our way up to one. Was I balancing on this little plaque? Uh, Try not to push okay. too hard, South South. Uh, defeat Zhang Jian to make the bluff successful. Oh, we were bluffing them. Okay. I didn't mean to do that, Musa. Damn it. It's a problem I really need to fix so later on. Yee. Enemy is focused on us. Continue the advance. Oh, wait, is that the end of the mission? Okay, there we go. I was waiting for that line to come up. I shall remember your efforts. Okay, a dis let's see. A diversity tactic two. So there's a second part to this mission. Uh completing this mission will allow Gorgia's plan to succeed. Okay. Uh defeat. Han Jian, Li Jiu, or Li Yu, and the required number of enemies to make sure the bluff succeeds. Okay, now that is our next mission. Lag. Oh, is there lag? Dang it. Well, there's really nothing I could do about that. Let's go. The enemy does not stand a chance against our might. Damn it, I love that arrow attack. <laughs> That used to be his special in earlier games. And by earlier games, I mean 7 and 8. That's when they introduced the EX attacks, which is now known as special, which is what that attack is. Ah, oh, damn it. I lost the chance to instant KO. Our target has been determined. Capturing that area will deflate their morale. I went too far. I went too far. Okay. You know what? This would be a great time for a Musa. Mm, I just realized something. I kind of, uh... I kind of understand why they won't let you use spirit powders or any type of spirit items which are used to replenish your Musa meter. Uh, they, they don't allow you to use those items during a Muso attack. Because you could essentially use an infinite Muso if you were to uh, continuously activate those items. And that just isn't fair. Still use them when the Muso is done, but well, it's not such. Did I run out of spirit powders already? Ooh. I'm gonna have to go back to a village so I can restock soon. Okay, this is taking a lot longer than I thought. What the? Damn it! You pushed me straight into an aerial Musa. Oh, they're calling the bluff. They're doing it. They're coming straight out of the castle to face us. Well, this was the plan all along. <laughs> yeah, and we took care of those two officers. Uh, what happens if you reach level 100? Uh, to be honest, I don't know. Uh, I guess you're just basically all that all powerful. To be honest, I, I'm not even sure if there's a level 100 cap. Because in most Dynasty Warriors games, the levels go beyond 100. No, 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 wait, 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 I'm wrong. It only goes past 100 if you're playing an Extreme Legends version, which is an expansion of one of the mainline games. 
Like in Dynasty, for example, in Dynasty Warriors 8, if you, you, once you get to level 100, that's the level cap. But when you play the Extreme Legends version, uh, the level cap goes all the way to 150. But at that point, you can use certain uh, features that the Extreme Legends game added to raise uh, your stats. So you can basically have a character who's level 150 with 9,999 points in every single stat. In fact, that's what I'm working on recently with some of my uh, best characters. Okay, so next mission. There is... Oh, the main mission is... Def well, the main mission that takes us closer to Wan Castle is defeat Jashu and Huchir. But... Hmm, we can do that and then also head straight to these other missions outside of Wan Castle to make things a little easier. Hey, what level are we? We are level 40. And some of these missions are under our level. Okay, so we're basically set to, I guess, fight Jashu and Huchir. Wait, did I? Alright, just to be sure, I'm gonna add a waypoint. Alright, so we'll defeat these two and then head for the other missions if we need to. Over 9,000. <laughs> yeah, basically. Huchir. Uh. Oh, hey, there's Dion Wei. You know, for a guy who was pricked by a bunch of arrows uh, a couple minutes ago, you have a surprisingly large hitbox now. Uh, not hitbox. You have a surprisingly large health bar now. Well, I'm glad to see you're okay and nothing bad will ever happen to you again, Dion Wei. Joshu is attempting to rendezvous with Puchir. Okay. We should probably defeat Huchir before he, before they rendezvous. And so is Shaho Yuan. There is still hope despite the circumstances. Knowing the way, I should not have expected anything less. That's right. Never disrespect the warriors of old, Cao Cao, as you always put it. Again, I do that move so right after the special on accident. I, I keep, I gotta keep, I gotta keep in mind that you just need to press the button once. You have to hold it down. Because the special, uh... Look away from me, Joshu. Look away. Alright, so now that we defeat Huchir, let's go straight to Jashu. Who's already right here! <laughs> Instant juggle! Oh, no, 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 no. oh there's my human. We ambushed him so fast that he didn't even get his. No, I don't want to grapple! Okay. But yeah, ambushed Joshu so fast that he didn't even get his uh, character introduction scene. Which also means that he which pretty much uh, Which pretty much shows that he is a playable character. I mean the fact that he has his own unique design probably tells you that. Already tells you that, but then again there are unique officers in this game, so. Who's to say you wouldn't know? But the fact that he is a playable officer means that he has a lot of defense. So it's gonna take a little longer than normal officers to defeat him. But not long enough. I wasn't expecting to find two such monsters in Cao Cao's army. I have no choice but to surrender. It looks like we've taken care of the bulk of the enemy forces. Now it's time for me to really make my presence felt. Alright. Well and it looks like we have Jashu 
surrendered to us, which means there might be a chance he can join our forces later. Who knows, this is Southside South we're talking about, of course, so probably have him join us. Alright, so that takes care of the this mission. So it seems like we have a couple more left. There is Rescue the Scout Unit. Completing this mission allows Gorgia's plan to proceed. Oh, uh, we kind of already saved Dion Way at this point. I just... <laughs> Ah, uh, but we'll, um, we might as well do it. Yeah, I just realized I basically ignored my own strategist by running straight to Dion Way. <laughs> to protect my lord! <laughs> that line delivery. Okay, so what exactly are we doing here? Leiju is who we have to fight here. Ah, there he is! Hello! You can't. You just lost your best warrior and your best strategist. Let's activate it. Okay, good. His voice scares me a little. Who, Dion Wei? Yeah. He does sound very gruff. Okay, I, I, we, I think this mission is pretty much done. We already defeated Lei Zhu. Sao Zhu, shut the f- We're advancing as fast as possible. Okay, fine, fine, we'll advance. Uds. Issue. I'm basically just waiting until the results come up. <laughs> I have been surrounded by the enemy. Just when I need to deliver this information to Master Guo Jia too. Uh, dude, I already saved you. You. Okay, fine, fine. Going to make it out of there. Now I can deliver this message to Master Guojia. Yes, and preferably not screaming at us to advance. Okay. So, what is our next mission? Question, questioning Eugene. Wait, what? Completing this mission allows your allies to advance to the front lines. Success condition meet with Eugene. Well done, you win. An excellent display. That's a point, thank you. Oh wait, we're going to question Eugene? What for? Let's see exactly what. Wait, where is he? Oh, why can't I move? Wait, I'm not moving. Why am I not moving? This is as far as I go. What? What? Wait, why? What happened? Dion Wei has been defeated? Oh, but I saved his ass. I failed to protect <laughs> my lord. I should be ashamed to call myself his bodyguard. <laughs> no! Death. Is a crime deserving of the harshest punishment. But I'm right back I here. Carry it out myself. Okay. Dion, wait, why are you all the way at one castle? Uh, our allies are attacking us. It's a rebellion led by Master Eugene. Okay, whatever. This is way more interesting than what just happened. Eugene, what yes. the hell, man? You're asking me why I'm doing this? These people are thieves and need to accept responsibility for their actions. Those who disturb the order and discipline of our ranks must be punished. The fact that we are on the battlefield changes nothing. What am I to do? Huh. Well, at least he's very stern with his uh, 
Cuties. Excuse, <laughs> Excuse me. Lord Gorgia with C word per Master Shu. Oh, yeah. You're asking me why. From that mission that this? I just did. These. Okay, so we spoke to him. What exactly do we have to do now? Hmm. Zhang Ji and Dong Wei are at Wang Cast. Dong Wei. Right. right, you are. You must be expecting Master Cao Cao too, and defeating him is the only way to get there. <laughs> a heartless plan, manipulating even emotions. I quite like it, but it won't work. Shall we? Our response is to, is to take out the fire attack. Units to the north the and south of one castle. Out. Now we can resume our advance and attempt to make up for lost time. It wasn't a betrayal. Still, that was pretty frightening for me. Really? Uh, that, that was a waste of time. And I thought something interesting would happen with Eugene. I guess not. Oh. Since we're already here, let's stop by the shopkeeper. Because we do need more uh, spirit welcome, items. Welcome. We, we need spirit pills that are right here. Uh, oh, we could use more vitality pills as well. Uh, basically, m everything that we can get our hands on. Spirit powder, strength pill... Yeah, that's pretty much it. Do please come again. Okay, let's switch this out for fear pills, I guess. Do we need do we really need strength pills at the moment? Oh, the damage we're doing, I I I don't really think so. You can always slap on the spirit potions just in case we run out of spirit pills. Now for upgrade time. Hmm. We could always use more Muso. Alright. Now, what is next on our missions? There's defeat the fire attack unit 1 and defeat the fire attack unit 2. And then there's a bunch of side quests that are hidden. And then, th and then there's that mission. Hmm. I'm intrigued by that. I'm intrigued by this random mission out of nowhere. So you know what? I think I'm going to head to that one. So how have you been? Uh, it's pretty good, actually. Nothing much to say. I'm just enjoying Dynasty Warriors 9 here. Yeah, this is actually a pretty fun game in my opinion. I I've been having some fun with it. It's a little wonky sometimes as you might have seen from the glitches of- South -South's forces must have sniffed us out. Man. I ran straight into the defeat the fire attack units one. Damn it! We have to keep the fire attack units eh. safe. I'll just ignore it for now. I want to see exactly what this is over here. Raiding Jingyi. Completing this mission causes the enemies within Wan Castle to go into a state of panic. Best conditions to beat Kwai Yue and Kwai Liang. Oh, we could we could have used this before we went to save Dian Wei, actually. Now, take Wait. Defensive positions. No, did he die again? Oh, I son of a bitch! To protect my lord, I should be ashamed uh, to call myself his bodyguard. <laughs> when I said we were on a timer, I didn't think it would. I didn't think it would end this quickly. Uh, we start from last checkpoint. Yes. Okay, maybe, maybe doing all of these missions at once probably isn't the best idea. So let's just, let's just end it now. Let's go straight to Wan Castle. Have you been drinking again? Probably, I might as well have. Considering the bullshit that's happening here. 
You fail. <laughs> I failed like two times already. Okay, yeah, fuck it. Let's just go save Dion Wei from dying. And then have him die immediately afterwards. This doesn't make fucking sense. Maybe we've been off more than we can chew. It makes as much sense as keeping Guan Yu from dying at Fawn Castle before he dies immediately after. The power of our cavalry to bury South South's forces for good! Big Jean Well, don't mind if I do. Dude, your defense sucks. Like, seriously. Oh, and even Dion Wei is here with me. That's pretty cool. Oh, and he's even rowling due to that uh, aura that surrounds him. It's his body odor. Right, let's be a contrarian. Ariel Musso! Which really doesn't do much. Yeah, the Ariel Musso's in this game suck. This the end for me. Hey, stop poking me! Oh, we got a Lightning Lord gem. Uh, flow attack plus 5, counter damage plus 39%, attack speed plus 3. This seems like a pretty good gem, and it's a Lord gem. I don't think I've gotten that yet. Huh. Pretty nice drop. Oh. And there he goes. He dies right there. Okay, so when you die now, it's all right. Well done, you win. An excellent display. <laughs> Your voice is adorable. <laughs> Shucks. <laughs> Pokes. No, stop poking me. Master Sao Sao accepted Zhang Xiu's surrender. Your safety was assured. So why did you try and assassinate our lord? It is the tendency of the victor to rest on his laurels after a battle is won. I simply saw an opening for our side and exploited it. Whoa, whoa calm down there, Jack Sparrow. No need to talk so fast. To his upcoming showdown with Yuan Shao, no? As such, he immediately accepted our surrender. Surprisingly so, in fact. I never a very thought keen I'd be observation. Able to take advantage of the situation to overcome such insurmountable odds. Of course, it mattered not in the end. Because uh, now I'm very, very dizzy. Yes. It was only thanks to the efforts of Master Dion Wei that Master Cao Cao was able to escape. However, things could have easily gone quite differently. Yes, they. Really could have. <laughs> Where's Dion Wei? He is at peace now. No. Master Sao Sao. Not the I warrior for old. You, no you have bested us. I am ready to meet my fate, whatever you may deem it to be. In that case, Jiashu. I want you to join me. W wait a minute, my lord. You're planning to let him live? Even after all he's done? Well, you gotta admit, his skills are pretty impressive. Punished. It should be me for falling victim to this trap and losing Dion Wei. Jiashu's talent as a strategist, the skill of Zhang Cho's men to execute the plot. In my opinion, that is something to be rewarded, not punished. But give him a pat on the back and a Zhang lollipop Xu, for Jesus. Is it possible that you sake. foresaw this very outcome? <laughs> I wonder. It was all part of my anyway, plan. Just I as planned. I appreciate your rather generous 
punishment, Master Tsao Tsao. <laughs> Rojia, I want you and Shun Yo to keep an eye on Jia Shu, at least for a while. Yo. I may covet his talent, but that does not mean we can trust him yet. I must do all that I can to quickly subdue the central plains and prepare for Yuan Shao's move south. Well, it's going to be a lot harder now that we lost our some of, one of our best warriors. On Shu province and capture Xia Pi. But at least we still have Shu Shu. Himself. Everyone, begin making the necessary preparations. Like he's right there. I think that was the point, Scar. If only I'd been there, we could have prevented all this. It should have been me. It should have been me burning should in hell you? right now. You can't blame yourself for this. You simply followed your orders out there. No, the responsibility for this falls squarely on my shoulders. Do you suppose Dian Wei would approve? Of me turning Jia Xu to our side? Lord Cao Cao. Lord Cao Cao. I mean Cao Cao. Tian Wei was not the type to hold a grudge. Cao Cao. I imagine you know that. Ironic, considering his appearance and voice. Yeah, he's right. I'm sure he's smiling to think it's just yeah, the type yeah, that's of move true. you'd make. <laughs> Although, I imagine he must be a bit lonely right now. My lord, in hell. What do you say we raise a toast in his honor? Indeed. Tonight, let us celebrate Dian Wei's life. I'm going to need a thousand death. bottles in order to hold my. I can't keep that shushu voice going. It hurts my throat. And then the peppy music plays. Yeah, Dian Wei's dead. Who put these onions in here? Oh, just you wait. There will be way more onion bowls later on. Master Cao Cao, you must excuse this sudden visit. My sworn brother, Lu Bei, is in Xiao Pei, which has come under siege from Lu Bu's forces. Lu Bu again. To loan me some of your troops to repel Lu Bu. So Lu Bu's finally making his move. Sturdier than a fucking cockroach. Staying in there is merit in us eliminating Lu Bu from the equation. However, if we move now, Liu Biao may strike us from behind. Junyo. Ah uh, yes, what you Liu think. Biao. Who I believe Lu Bu is currently the only Liu Bei is working for at this moment. Plus. There are no other forces that will go to his Or is he going to work we with him later on? I I, I I don't remember my history all too well. However, a siege will take time. Let's kill Lu Bu once and for all. Down with the Lu Bu. In that case, how about this strategy? We dam the Ishui and Sushui rivers that run near Shapi, inundating the castle with water. Going to flood that the loop loop. Idea. We will channel the water into the castle at Sha P. We simply need to seize control of the floodgates to make it happen. Very well. We shall proceed with your plan. Begin making preparations for the flood attack. This is our best chance to slay the demon Lu Bu. Uh, you think water will actually kill Lu Bu this time? Eh, probably not. But Shahu Yuan can. I am confident that Master Guojia and I will be successful. All right, this is it. Our final confrontation with Lu Bu, once and for all, at Xia Pi. Reclaim Xia Pi, defeat Lu Bu and Chen Gong. Okay, so let's see our missions for now. Our important missions are opening the floodgates, obviously, which are near Xia Pi. There's also a couple of random missions here and there. 
One of them includes a mission with Liu Bei and Guan Yu. There's a couple of random officers here and there. Yeah, just a couple of randoms. Now, who is this? Sao P? Hey, it's Sao P! A flood attack. Guo Jia and Shun Yo are brilliant indeed. Everyone, this is our chance to rid ourselves of Lu Bu for good. I didn't even think he was alive at this point. Where is he? It, it's supposed to be right here. Oh, oh, it, it took a while for him to load. How's it going? How's it going, right. nephew? Our battle preparations can be left to the others. Oh, wait. <clears throat> I simply need myself a handful of the best soldier, swordsmen. Of you and Xiao. Oh, hello, random person in red. <laughs> <laughs> I enjoy taking in a meal with the regular people every now and then. The lack of... Th okay. Thank you for ending the conversation. <laughs> the lack of extravagance seems to bring out an extra flavor in these dishes. That sounds completely different from the Sao P I know, but okay. Alright, so I didn't even know Sao P was alive at this point. Then again, the Battle of Guandu happens very shortly after these events, so... And I believe Sao P was around his teen years, so I, I, I guess it makes sense. But anyway... One of those unsightly positions. We have Sao P as one of our contacts. So, let us head straight to one of our hideouts just to see what we can do with that. Oh, I forgot I had the Rocky music playing in this place. <laughs> Narrow escape, yeah. Wait, what is it called? Dead Maximalist. Oh, yeah, that's rocking. <laughs> that's a fucking rocking name. After you said that, he just stood up. Wait, what did I say? Uh, probably too long. Okay, uh... Fuck it, let's be informal for a while. Ha. <laughs> oh, I'll never get used to that square looking face on Shaho you want. Let me check our contacts. Ah, and there's Salpy. Hmm. Yeah, let's 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 invite him here. Now we just we need to wait for him to arrive. Oh, there he is! Okay. Sometimes it takes officers to, like... Sometimes it takes officers pretty quickly to get here. Sometimes it's quick, sometimes it's not. Sometimes they just don't appear at all. I have no idea what dictates that. Right. There you are. I was about to give you... I was about to give up and leave. And I'm surprised you couldn't sense on my impending visit. <laughs> I'm just... Oh, okay. You were about to leave, but I was here the whole time. Use it wisely. Here. Uh, I can't read that. It's so, it's so bright. Take, take this. It is rather. Oh fuck it. I got a damaged tiger pelt. Salpi, why did you have that? I admit, I find you quite interesting. Oh, he actually says this. Can we talk like this from time to time? You're honored to have caught my attention. What a kiss ass. Because I am technically his uncle at this point. I want to talk to South South. Uh, alright, let's, let's send South South. Oh, wait, I think we can only get one officer per day. So I don't think South South's going to show up. Yeah, it doesn't look like he's going to show up at all. Eh, let's just spend this time seeing what we can cook. Do we really need to cook something right now? I mean, we could use this attack buff for when we're facing Lubu, 
But will it last long enough until we get to Lubu? You know what? It lasts for 30 minutes, so I'm pretty sure it will. 30 minutes in game time, at least. And I really don't want to... Oh, we can actually uh, craft some spear powders. Couple, at least. Up to 14. Okay, that's pretty good. Alright, I am I think we're set. Oh yeah, and you can't wear your informal attire outside of your hideout. Which is extremely unfortunate, because some of the informal attire does look pretty good. For example, like Genji's, uh, Zhang Shunhua. Those look really nice. But oh well. Okay, so what do we have to do? We'll obviously open the floodgates. Uh, there is a particular mission with the Liu Bebe over here. Sneaks into your house. <laughs> no, I already have enough people sneaking into my house. I already have my nephew sneaking in. Not you too. Okay, yes, this is the mission with Liu Bei. With Liu Bebe. And Guan Yu. <laughs> God damn it. What happened last what happened uh two days ago during that last session was just suddenly hilarious. Like I knew Guan Yu was I, I know Guan Yu in history is a pretty terrible commander. But I didn't think it would actually happen as a glitch in this game. Oh man. I'm gonna have so much fun when I'm playing as this story. Are you literally not attacking the forces, Guan Yu? Oh, not again. Guan Yu, seriously, you're being under attack. What the fuck is with him? Oh. Oh, what is our mission? Defeat Gao Shun and Sao Xing. We're defeating a Sao? Okay, now he's attacking. Interesting. There's a sow on their side. We're gonna secure the area. I didn't expect that. Yeah, what the fuck, traitor? I mean, you may not be a part of Cao Cao's army, but... Dude, you never disrespect family. And that's what you get. You pay the ultimate price. Okay, now what is, who do we have to face next? But well, we have to defeat Gao Shun, but I, I can't see him on the map. He's supposed to be in this direction. Where is he? Uh, Gao Shun, where the fuck are you? Is that you? There you are. We'll be swallowed by the Lu Bu. Uh, you mean I have come to Liu, Liu, Liu Bei's rescue, cousin? Oh, he's got a point there. I have no idea who that guy is. Man, I fucking love the OST in this game. I don't think I've said that enough. Like, every track in this game is just masterful. Yeah, it's an excellent display. Thank you, cousin. Gary Scott. I wanted his magic food. <laughs> yeah, thanks, Justice Wolf. Thanks. Alright, so what is our next objective? Well, in terms of any famous officers, there doesn't seem to be anything. Yeah, there just seems to be random missions here and there. Well, this, since this is the closest, let's, let's deal with this mission. 
Because not only does it, is it close, but it also takes place in a town. To reclaim Peng Chen. Now what is this all about? Completing this mission allows your allies to advance to the front lines. Defeat Zangba. Oh, we're sending in the Sage Towers. Our objective is to capture that area. Okay, since these are more important than the Bliss Day over there, let's just get the Sage Towers to the walls as fast as possible. But get the fuck out of our way! Like, seriously, I'm surprised this thing that just doesn't... just doesn't drive over you all. Oh, who are you? Zong, but wait, you're our objective! Wait a minute, is that your Sage Tower? It is! I've been trying to help you! Okay, fuck you. What the fuck was I thinking? Oh, thank you for your help. Your aid helped us keep Pen Castle from being lost. I was fighting in this battle. What the? Of course we won. Hey, I was dancing. I was busy dancing. You're not too shabby. Just waiting for the mission to clear. Let's go. Now is the time to attack. Seriously, does it? Why is it still playing the battle music if I've already cleared the mission? Ah, I don't know. Okay, so what do we have- what else do we have to do here? Oh, this one unlocked. Defeat Ho Chang, Wei Zhu, and Song Jian. Completing this mission allows your allies to advance into the inner Xia Pi. Hmm, that could prove to be useful, but... And I am pretty close to it. But I want to deal with the floodgates now. Ah, there's no place to teleport to, so I, I guess I could just do it. I It is the closest mission after all. I love that dance. Shake your booty. No. If I was the Chan, I would, but I'm not sure you are. Oh snap, it's playing the Xia Pi music. Damn it, another track that's great in this game. Okay boys, let's go get some food. My milkshake brings on- No, I can't even say that in that voice. Wait, was that really it? Oh, don't, don't poke me! Oh wait, there's still this guy. Wei Zhu, I believe. Yep, Wei Zhu. Eh, it doesn't matter, you're already dead anyway. Alright, now you guys can head straight into Shapi. You're welcome. Let's go handle these floodgates. Oh! And suddenly, Zhang Liao. Zhang Liao has head straight to that floodgate. Oh wait, that could prove a huge problem. So let's head straight over. Damn it. We have to actually travel there by horse. I bet there's food there. Okay, boys. <laughs> I can just imagine Big the Cat saying that, because that's literally what his voice sounds. We all know our target. It is only a matter of attacking it. Ah, I see the floodgate. It's right there. Yeah. 
They must be targeting the floodgates to launch a flood attack against us. I cannot allow that to come to pass. All right, then bring it on, Zhang Liao. Wherever, wherever you are, <laughs> you're on the other side of the lake. Allow them to interfere with our strategy. I must hurry on ahead. Actually, since you're already at the other side of the lake, might as well go behind your back and do this real quick. To those of you who support Lu Bu, know that to oppose me is to invite death upon you. Wait, can I actually destroy this right now? Do I actually have to defeat Zhang Liao in order to destroy the floodgates? Uh, okay. <laughs> <You're hardest. laughs> that voice crack. Alright, Zhang Liao. Yeah, not so tough now that you don't have Lu and Chi with you, huh? Actually, that reminds me. Where the... Where is Lulin Chi? I don't even think she's in this mission. Oh yeah, because she basically leaves Lubu's forces before Xiaopi. I mean, if she was here, then she probably would die. Uh, now that I think about it, that probably also means that Lulin Chi's story is very, very short. Like many other character stories in this game. Pour into the castle. Take care that you're not swept away by the water. There we go. I was fighting wow, that this of course we won. That destruction animation. Well done, you win. An excellent display. Ah sweet, you got to level 44. See what points we can distribute now. I'm pretty good at my with my Musso meter at times. So let's yeah, we'll pump all our points into uh, stamina for now. All right, second floodgate. Let's go. Ah, sweet! I got the line again. Does it mean anything? Not at all. But it, it's still awesome to get a thousand kills. It's mostly for bragging rights at this point in the Dynasty Wars franchise. You plan on breaking the floodgates and flooding Shappy? I will never allow that! This is our best chance to kill. Zhang Hu? For a second there, I thought you were Zhang He. Nah, you're not you're not fabulous enough to be Zhang He. I can't believe it. I've dropped my guard. I have shamed my father's name. Father's name? Zhang Oh, Zhang Liao! Oh, Zhang Liao is your father! I cannot believe that I was bested, even after giving it my all. Also, I just realized Zhang Liao and Zhang He are technically related in some sense. We completely destroyed this Oh, that's, that's a weird thought. <laughs> yes, that is wonderful news. It looks like I accomplished my duty admirably. <laughs> yes, I do. I do say. Successfully destroyed the floodgates. Ah, we did it! Oh, ho, ho, ho. Oh, ho, ho, ho. these guys are so dead. You can't see me right now, but I'm twiddling my fingers. <laughs> Too late. Nobody can escape the water. Oh, fuck, I'm feeling like Suma Yi at the moment. <laughs> Ha 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 ha.
He would laugh at a time like this. Okay, that takes care of things here. Now, to meet up with Master Tsao Tsao and the others. I was so excited! That flood attack was so spectacular! Water attack has lowered the military strength of Lubu's forces. Yep, and even our morality is higher than his now. Hmm. A water attack? How petty. Fire arrows at the intruders from the realm. Of course. Fire arrows. Fire it at fire the fire the yeah. arrows straight at the water. I just thought of water. We must ensure that each unit regroups at once. Yeah. Why is the gate opening? Shao Shao's forces have attacked! We're being under attack? No. Ah, oh, sweet, the gate, all the gates have opened. I was fighting in this battle. Of course we won! Well done, Yuen. An excellent display. Why are they running so slow? I need everyone. <laughs> because they're not famous officers. A bunch of random nameless mooks. All right, seriously, open the floodgates too. Can that can that be done already? Let's go capture one of those unsightly positions. Follow me. Did I not Let's do everything? One of those unsightly positions. Follow me. Yes, thank you, Parrot. Why does this still technically count as a mission? Uh, okay, you already said that. Uh, this... Uh, another thing I can pl complain about this game is that the dialogue takes forever to cycle through. This... This is a huge problem. <laughs> you just keep repeating that same line over and over and over again. I've heard in recent updates that they've actually fixed that in some sense. But I don't have the update yet. Let's go capture one of those unsightly positions. <sighs> Follow me. I'm skipping you guys. I'm going away now. I'm heading straight into the castle. <laughs> okay, so why isn't this gate opened? Let's go capture one of those unsightly Okay. Follow me. I'm getting tired of you. Master Fuck it, I'm go. using my grappling hook. We finished destroying this floodgate. Excellent. Okay, finally! We have accomplished our duty here. There, the, the floodgate's open. Yes, it was open like five minutes ago. Now we can begin moving towards Shopee Castle. Yeah. We will meet up with our allies on the front line. Yeah, you can move Slave. now. I was fighting in this battle. Of course we won. Let's go capture that unsightly position. Well done, you Too late, I've already captured it. Excellent display. Okay. Uh, persuading Ho Chen, Wei Zhu, and Song Jian. Wait, didn't we just defeat them? Oh, now we have to persuade. Wait. Eh? We have to persuade the people that we defeated. Uh, uh, okay, let's just go see exactly what this is all about. All right, I need everyone to defend this area. Enemy forces have infiltrated the castle. Damn, this place is flooded. Master Lubu, I suggest a plan to deal with them. I do not need a plan to crush intruders. I will just stop on whoever I see. Uh, and there goes the meathead Lubu again. Oh, we do have to persuade them. Wait, where are they? Uh, th we defeated them earlier. Didn't we already defeat them and they're all dead? Despite all of his strength, <laughs> he was unable to win the hearts of his retainers. Dynasty Wars 9. 
on my side. <laughs> this is Foundation Dynasty Warriors 9 at its finest. A somewhat glitchy yet enjoyable mess. It's a glitchy mess, but ah, uh, it's my glitchy mess. <laughs> okay, now it says I completed the mission. They skipped bleachers for gyms, I guess. <laughs> Probably. From the grave, yeah. Never mind what I said. Oh, okay. Did he look like the evil version of Cao Cao? Who, uh... Cheng Gong? Eh, sort of. It's that mustache. That glorious mustache. But yeah, since we've already done all the missions around Shappy, let's just go and finish this. Let's go and fight Cheng Gong and Lubu. And... Wait, is that really it? Just Cheng Gong and Lubu, not Diao Chan? What the... I just realized something. We didn't fight Diao Chan during our last encounters with Lubu. She's usually supposed to be in Zha Pi. Oh, this is interesting. Are you willing to face me in battle? Oh yes, unlike last time, Chen Gong is actually the one protecting Lu Bu. Oh, and there he is. You have courage. Okay. Here we go. The third time we've encountered Lu Bu in this story. And I pretty much know what to do now. Strength pill instantly. Not allow a single enemy through. Okay, we've already used our strength pill. Let's slap back on the spear pills. There we go. Wait, where did he go? Oh! Chen Gong disappeared, but suddenly Lu Bu showed up. All right then, Lu Bu. Let's. let's I'm over here, idiot. <laughs> Yo, imbecile, I'm over here! Wow, instant juggle. This hasn't happened before. Holy shit, his... His HP is dropping like... <gasps> We just defeated the little dude a couple of hits. What the fuck are in those strength pills? Let me go! You impudent maggots! How dare you place loops on the mighty Lu Okay, I was expecting a large climactic and epic battle between Lu Bu once again, but nope. Nope, I guess he was just... It just wasn't his day. <laughs> Alright, I, I guess we have to deal with Chen Gong now. I, I didn't even get to use my Muso on Lu Bu. But I can't use it on Chen Gong. <laughs> ooh, ooh. <laughs> I heard that. I heard that, Chen Gong. <laughs> is he easy to take down with Lu Bu? Yes, yes he is. <laughs> that death cry. Very good. I shall remember your efforts. You relied on sheer might while shunning intellect and cunning. That is what led to your downfall, Boo Boo. Weren't there wasn't there a bunch of soldiers here just now? Yeah. Ah, screw it. We won! Woohoo! Can we take the capital? Can we take the capital? Oh wait! Can we? Oh, I was about to head to the to the building, the main building. Oh, special cutscene time.
Oh boy. I can't believe I lost to someone weaker than me. Let's see how Dynasty Warriors 9 Something is going to handle strategy. this cutscene. Someone like you, who depends on physical strength, will never be me. <laughs> then tell me, what would happen if you add my strength to this thing you call strategy? Ubu, are you begging to be so saved? To to yes, he is. You fucking imbecile. Don't let desire for strength deceive you. Uh, damn you, Liu Bei! Uh, uh. Oh snap! Oh snap! Let your pride and be the best. Die with you here in Xiaopi. Uh. Damn! What a way to go. Uh, not as epic as it was in uh, 8 Extreme Legends. But still. It was still awesome. Sao Sao got the spotlight in this cutscene. You have my most profound gratitude for your aid. That was my best chance to finally slay Lu Bu. There is no need for you to thank me. In translation, fuck you. So. But I owe you a debt nonetheless. My word is my bond. Guan Yu, I wish to speak Goodbye with you now. <laughs> I would like for you to join my cause. Your might is equal to that of the This ragtag group of misfits. I could use one <laughs> They're all lined up like some valor. sort of uh Gang or boy band. <laughs> I am not worthy of such praise, they even have the pretty boy there. But my place is alongside my sworn brother Liu Bei. I am afraid I must decline your generous offer. But, 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 but we have Bay cookies. Does not even begin to comprehend the magnitude of your greatness. We have Lube Boop. I care not what others may think. I will serve and support my brother. Forgive me. Eh, loyal, even to the very end. Wait, it's not the very end yet. Yet. <laughs> Cao Cao, don't grow too fond of Guan Yu. He will never agree to serve alongside us. Dune, are you jelly? I wouldn't be so quick to give. Well, not him this game now. There is still a possibility that we may be able to use him, even if only for a short while. Master Cao Cao. You and Xiao will defeat Gong Sun Zun before long. As such, ah, yes, Gong Sun Zun, the person that Liu Bei is working for at this time. No. Liu Bei enjoys the service of the mighty Guan Yu and Zhang Fei. We should utilize them to defeat Yu and Shu while we still have the chance. Yeah, so Liu Bei is working for Gong Sun Zun at this point. The showdown for and then Guan later he'll work for there, Liu Biao, meaning I believe. Yeah, yeah, he will. Central Plains in order to prepare for our own confrontation with Yuan Shao. So this is basically all built up to this epic battle against Yuan Shao that we that we pretty much have to face soon. It's like I said uh, before, Lu Bu is literally just a distraction. He's well, he's more of an annoyance than anything. It's unfortunate when one of your most favorite characters is deemed an annoyance in the main story. Alright, so... I guess we have to head back to Xu Cheng in order to continue with the story. So let's go. Wait, you have cookies? Yeah, I do. <laughs> You're joining. <laughs> We're gonna game but Scar! Okay. But everything suddenly became black. What the hell? Okay, so what do we do now? Yep, we reclaim Shapi. I am sorry. Yeah, you should be.
being dirty in my own stream. <laughs> That was my lord, I want a mission. No, you get nothing. You get nothing after that statement you just had. Seriously, why is it loading this? My lord, Yuan Shu has named himself emperor and is marching north. Oh, we're just getting this so, information now? Yuan Shu has made his move. Although facing him will expose us to Yuan Shao, we cannot leave him be. Then you must allow us to join your cause, Master Cao Cao. This is our opportunity to repay the debt we owe you from Sha Pi. Besides, I cannot forgive one who would take the Emperor's name in vain. I think that is a brilliant proposal. Master Cao Cao, we should agree to accept Master Liu Bei's assistance in this matter. Rumor has it that the current ruler of the Sun family, Sun Se, is considering leaving you in shoes. <laughs> Sun Se. We should consider working together with him. Uh, and this is where we're getting introduced into the Soon well. family. Well, actually, you. we were already introduced to the Soon family in we like chapter one once and for all. by Soon Jian, who had helped us during the Yellow Turban's Rebellion. But then we got that spoiler that he died. The Emperor Yuan Shu. All units, forward. Yeah. Well, I guess that's not yeah. going to be a surprise when we play yeah. as Soon Jian in his story. Defeat Yuan Shu's position in the main camp of Shochun. The campaign against Yuan Shao. It was like this is like the third mission into this chapter, and we still haven't unlocked the chapter information, which probably means there's going to be another m main mission in this chapter. So, the man who ruled the plains. We actually get to do the Battle of Guandu in this chapter well it, it obviously makes sense i mean the guandu plains but anyway our main mission for now is to defeat yuan shu who's stationed in shochun so our main no we don't we don't really have a lot of main uh story related missions we have defeat yuan yin uh just completing this mission allows your allies to advance to the front lines and we have preventing the call of reinforcements. Same thing. Defeat Ji Ling, who is planning on leaving the battle. Really? Up to Whoa, wait a minute, what? Photo mode? <gasps> wait a minute. Did I get the update? Oh shit, okay. So this is a big surprise. I I didn't expect the update for the Xbox One version to come out this quickly, but I believe this is the 1.06 update. Uh, er earlier in like the, the last stream, I only had the 1.04 update. Uh, for this new one, it adds this photo mode as well as a bunch of other features. So this is, this is going to be completely new to me, and I'm actually pretty excited to see this. So, <clears throat> photo mode. Photo mode allows you to freely move the camera and take photos. With photo mode, you can take photos from a very variety of angles, and you can freely set the time of day and weather as you wish. Okay, this is an, a pretty interesting feature that I've seen. So, <laughs> you can basically just pause the game as it is and mess with the uh, with it like this as its photo mode. So. As you see, I pause it as I was riding my horse. Uh, I can freely move it at will. This is the move the camera, rotate camera, raise camera with the R1, lower camera with RT, reset to where it was, a UI display, the pause button, fast camera LR. Oh, I, I hold down the LR button, and the slow camera is the LT button. That's really fucking slow. Okay, and yeah, I can basically move it freely at will, much as I want. <laughs> I can have stuff like this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
Yo. <laughs> yes, it's so blurry. He's so fucking blurry. Oh man, this is so cool. I am so excited to actually have this feature now. I've been waiting for this for like a few weeks since it was released. So let me see. I think I'm going to exit photo mode for now because I'm taking way too much time just geeking out at it. <laughs> oh, what are the comments saying? Shazam Zap updates start appearing. I know, right? I was so surprised by it. I didn't even notice it. I, I guess I had it this whole time, but I never actually pressed... But I never actually went to the left side of this menu. Riding that horse. <laughs> no dirty cop. Fuck it. <laughs> Damn it. Damn it, Scar, you always seem to do that. Okay. Let's see what we have to do. There's a mission involving the three sworn brothers. Prevent the call to reinforcements. Let's just go to that one. And hey, we might as well ride on our horse all the way over there. Ride as drunk as possible. <laughs> v -v -v. Oh, I think I had too much. <laughs> this would make more sense if we were playing as Sun Chuan. Oh man, it's been a long, it's been a while since I've since I've uh, bothered riding my horse to different locations, because I've already mapped out most of the uh, central plains. So there was really no need for me to ride on my horse. Wait, you're trying to plan a, a peace treaty? It says you're planning on leaving the battle. I don't know what to believe anymore. Not too late, but I've already killed your. I already killed your ally. Okay, that's pretty much it, right? Calm down, John Fei. This may all be an enemy trap. Oh, there's another officer over there. Young on. Seriously, dude, I killed you, like, a while ago. Hmm. Okay, now that I'm thinking... I just want to test something out real quick. Okay. I fired my bow and arrow right there. Now let's see exactly what the photo mode shows. <laughs> what the fuck is that animation? <laughs> <laughs> See, <laughs> oh, I can even follow the arrow. Whoa, that thing's going pretty damn fast. Whoosh. <laughs> oh. Hey, Guan Yu. Hey. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> Okay, I actually want to take this, cause take a picture of this, because it looks pretty hilarious. Alright, let's check out some of the environmental features. <clears throat> okay, there's a time setting. <laughs> I'll set it like that. Oh, there we go. If I hold the X button down, it goes faster. Uh, what is the funniest time? Oh, around there, I guess. Wait. In the morning. Yeah, that's good. Ooh, I can even change the weather. There is sunny, cloudy, light rain, rain, heavy rain. Nice. Uh, it's a good game, actually. <laughs> light snow, snow, heavy snow, the sequel to Heavy Rain. Fog. No, we're not in Silent Hill. I think I'll go with Heavy Rain. 
see a camera exposure hmm make it as bright as possible <laughs> okay who turned my world upside down <laughs> angle uh Let's see <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, depth of field. Uh, I don't know what that means. Depth of focus. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know much of my uh, photography terms, so this basically just means nothing to me. Oh, okay, it's the focus. Uh, and I just focus on Shahu Yuan. Yes, I can. Okay. That's some pretty good focus right there. Focal range. Mm, I want it like that. Okay. <laughs> I flipped the world. Yep. I am your evil son. Color temperature. Ooh. I can make it all red. Or I can make it a little blue. It's a little droopy. Uh, I want to look like it's the apocalypse, so <laughs> red, red of course. Vivid, oh my god, that is, that is like sun red. Blue, even though the, the, the color temperature is red. <laughs> red, <laughs> I'll have it more, I'll have it redder, redder. Color effect intensity. Oh god, no, that that's too much red. Too much red right there. Uh chromatic out Ooh, that looks pretty cool. That's a pretty nice effect right there. Vignetta. Again, I don't know my I don't know these terms, so this is just This is gibberish to me. Okay, as much as I want it to be red, that 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 that, that looks terrible. So how about we'll have a compromise like that. Okay, that's good. So how exactly do I actually take a picture? Uh, there's rotate. Yeah, seriously, how do I take a picture of this? Wait, I didn't mean to exit photo mode. Wait, no! I lost all of my progress! No! I wanted to take a picture of that! Uh... Well, I have a bunch of other chances to take a picture of Shao Yuan turning the world upside down. But I still want to know how I can actually take an, a picture. Uh... Because it doesn't actually say on the UI down there. And there's no settings here either. Uh. You know, I'll just research this later on. Uh, later, after the stream. You are doing an excellent job. See how exactly I'm supposed to do that. And I'm definitely going to have some fun with, the, with this photo mode. Well then, the comments on this... Hey, Saiyan Rose. Yeah, <laughs> this has been this this has been a laugh fest, definitely. Oh man, I'm having so much fun. Uh, use your Xbox. Oh, I have to. Dang it, I should have known. What? Wait, it, this feature is also in the PlayStation uh, Four. I was actually supposed to take it on the PlayStation. Uh, again, I'll just research it later. For now, let's just let's just continue with the game. Okay, so there is a couple different missions here. Whoa! The mission all the way down there in the southeastern side. And it's a place I haven't actually visited yet. Did I even bother? Uh, the quickest warp location is over there. Eh, I guess I could spend some time to do this random mission.
I can show you. Uh, show me later. Show me later. We've already wasted enough time on this. <laughs> Jeez, it's taking a while to load. Ah, probably because I've never actually been to this place before. Yeah, that's probably why. Actually, since I'm in a new location, I might as well equip myself with something I think might be useful. Okay, I need the gold crown. That is essential. Uh, stores health plus three every second. Okay, that might not be all too useful. Beastly mirror. There it is. Expands the unlock area of the map. So as long as I'm in a new location, it'll expand the unlock area. And is that who I think it is? It's Da Chow! Hey, it's the Chow. She also has a mission over there. Oh, well, I, I, I definitely wouldn't pass the time to meet Da Chow, of all people. Let's head over there right now. Jiang Yi. Liu Bei and his men. How I loathe them. Sweep them aside. Sweep them aside. Where's my handmaidens when I need them? Did I seriously fall into this? Okay, good. There was a staircase right next to the water. Report! Lord Ji Ling has been defeated. Our alliance with you and Shao is over. Oh, snap. Did I see fire arrows? We can't expect any more aid? Then we surely can't expect to win either. Okay, so what exactly am I supposed to do here? I heard Dot Chow was here. Where do I meet her? Oh, hey, it's Zhou Yu. Uh, did, did, I com did I go in the completely wrong direction? Ah, screw it. We'll just do this mission for now. I shall personally see to its defense. Okay, seriously, activate the mission anytime you want. Okay, there it is. Defeat Yuan Yin. And where exactly is this Yuan Yin at? This place belongs to us. We will not give it up for anyone. Ah, he's over this wall. Now exactly am I supposed to get in there? Sigh, is this one of those moments where I'm forced to use my grappling hook? I guess it is. Alright, alright, I'll use it. I'll stop being a contrarian. There you happy game. You happy? What the? he's running! There is no greater Oh he better not book it. It is time he paid for his contemptible behavior. You said it, Chenpu. Get your ass fucking back here. Yeah, that's right. This is what you get for running. Are you still trying to run from me? Why can't I lock onto him? There you are. Now you better take your ass beating like a man. Not even fit to share the battlefield with me. Oh wait, that's Salpi. <laughs> Why did I have to live? Of course, you just completely missed me. Of course we won. All right, that's it for Zhang Yi. Now for assisting the supply units. Wait, who's that? Who's that right there? Soon Se. Wait, but where did Dacha go? Is this Dacha? That's Sao P. Wait, where did Dacha go? I wanted to meet her. Screw it. Screw it. Everything is ruined. Hey, hey, it's Genji. Genji's here too. Hey, all the females are here now. That's awesome. And even Zhang He. Seems like we're now we're getting to the point in the game where the females are actually becoming important. 
But either way, I think that's it for now in terms of the important missions. So let's just head straight to the main camp, the campaign against Yuan Shu. <laughs> Best live stream ever. You said that like three live streams ago. Well done. Oh, I guess that means they're, they're just getting better and better. Hmm, okay. I might as well show this off since I've never actually bothered to uh, go around in the horse. I was about to show off this neat little feature where uh, all throughout the map there are these uh, collectible, uh, breakable boxes that you can find materials in. But I just destroyed the box. And as it turns out, it has a bunch of materials that I already have and no, have no use for. Whoops. I guess I'm already too prepared for all this. I guess I could show off one neat feature. That I've been meaning to for a long time, actually. Let me just go into my items menu. And pull out... My bait. So yeah, there's fishing in the- oh. So yeah, there's fishing in this game. For a Dynasty Warriors game, fishing is uh, th something you honestly wouldn't expect. But the fact that this is an open world game now, it, 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 I guess this is a neat little feature. I mean, it's pretty damn harmless. Okay, so once you uh, cast your bait, you, you have... Uh, Wait, I probably should have. I should, probably should have explained how the fishing works. So when you activate the bait, it's essentially a waiting game for when this happens. When the fish starts bite, biting, you have a chance to catch it. So you, once the uh, fish starts biting, when it's going to, I'll wait until it starts biting again. Any second now. Any second. Any second. Patience was never my strong virtue. I'll admit. Oh, here it is. So when the fish starts biting, you have the chance to catch it. Uh, so you have to repeatedly mash the X button until you basically tire it out. Yeah, pretty nifty little mini game. That you can actually earn uh, quite a lot of uh, materials in order to cook, uh, materials to craft things, and even the occasional rare, rare coins. That if you got, if any of you remember from uh, the first Dynasty Wars Nine session, you use coins in order to craft the ultimate weapons in this game. In fact, fishing is one of the most recommended ways in order to grind for those said coins. It's how I would nift the ultimate weapons right here. There are also other methods, but... Fishing is just much more easier. Albeit very time consuming. I need everyone to defend this area. Oh, I remember, yeah. Alright, so we're here. The Battle of Shochu. How dare you raise your blades against me? I am your emperor. Someone slay these perfidious fools. Ah, uh, you want to? Still sounding as badass as always. This is our chance to push the enemy lines back. Follow me. If I was on his side, I would definitely work for him. But unfortunately, we're shot how you are, so. Oh, Fire Lord Gem. Hey, and I got an achievement! Collector, obtain 20 gems. Sweet. I don't know if the achievement turned up in the live stream, but it was definitely there. So, Fire Lord Gem. Trigger attack plus 25%. Attack plus 4. Musou plus 3 seconds. Okay, that is really good. Let's go right... That's going right into my weapon. Let's see, what gems can we take off for now? 
Hmm. The gem's attributes usually uh, stack onto the trigger attack that you're using, and I most of the time usually use the knockdown attack, so... Let's switch that out for a Fire Lord gem or a Lightning Lord gem. Hmm... Well... Lightning is usually associated with Shu. And I hate Shu with a passion, so let's go with Fire Lord. We're definitely pro U in this in this stream. Yep, and there's even a fire element with that trigger attack. Sweet. Alrighty, so what do we have to do here? Yeah, the door's not opening. What exactly do we have to do here? Do I? Oh, this is another mission where I have to use my grappling hook again. It better not be. Ah, let's just defeat these captains real quick and see exactly what we have to do afterwards. Damn, that... Fire Lord Gem is you go for now. definitely putting work. See that? I give Lady Gen hope. Ah, shucks. Alright, so there doesn't seem to be much I can do. Just defeating officers on the outside wall, so screw it! We're gonna use my grappling hook again. Yeah, I try not to use the grappling hook too much. I know it's like a game-breaking feature, but... Dynasty Wars 9 is... Dynasty Wars 9 isn't the game I want to break. I want to actually have a decent challenge. Like, when I was facing uh, Lu Bu in Hulao Gate. Or when I wanted to face the three sworn brothers back at a uh, Tao Qian's mission. Which I didn't get because Guan Yu was being a fucking fucker. Ah, I was about to say something terrible, but no. Adorable voice. <laughs> Lady Jen brings that out of me, unfortunately. The, wait, I didn't mean to go to photo mode. Okay, so... Yeah, there doesn't seem to be much we can do. There's... Li Feng in our way. There's Cheng Ji. Yuan Yao, Zhang Jun, but those are pretty much... Meh officers. So screw it, we're going straight to Yuan Shu. If we can. I mean... Well, okay, yeah, if the gate's barred like this, then we probably can't. We'll probably need to defeat the officer in our way, so... Zhang Jun, you're unfortunately in our way, and you're really packing a punch. Fine, I'll use a Muso on you. You deserve it, I guess. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, did that open the gate? No. Oh, he was the one controlling these weapons. Yep, the weapons under his command have stopped. Sweet. So, we, we really don't even have to be attacking this thing anymore. Alright, seriously, come on, I want to open this gate already. I guess I'm gonna have to defeat all the officers that are in my way. And I said I wouldn't use my grappling hook, but... Oh. Oh, hello, Yuan Shu. Who is on the other side of the wall. What? And is attacking me on the other side of the wall? Very eager, motherfucker, aren't you? So anyway, yeah, as I was saying. I said I wouldn't use my grappling hook, but... 
I technically don't need my grappling hook at this point. You want to shoot seriously? Oh shit! <laughs> he straight up ambushed me. Okay, self-proclaimed emperor, I really do like your character, but you unfortunately have to go now. Yeah, even... Even without the strength pills, I'm still more of a match for him than anything. Ah, goodbye, Yuanshu. See you in the DLC! I am the Emperor! How could I be forced to endure such an outrage? You are still pathetic, what the f even after calling yourself Emperor. You will never have what it takes to rule this land. Yes, your deeds will go down in legend. Ha, <laughs> you can attack me. I was able to do my dance. My Lord, you the fu Why is it so foggy Manu. here? I have Listen, are we in Silent Hill or something? And now Yuan Shao has control of Hebei. We may have no greater opportunity than the present. It seems the time for our inevitable showdown has finally arrived. Yes. I didn't think it could get Yuan this foggy. Yuan Shao may outnumber us on paper, but I have faith in the superior talent of my men. Uh, it's time. We shall return to Xu Chang. We must begin making preparations for this final battle. Yep, the moment we've all been waiting for. The battle against Yuan Shao. It's starting. Yuan Shu has been slain. Now we can turn our attention to Yuan Shao. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Sounded like he just saw a bug. It seems like I don't have oh, much What the fuck was that? Left. However, I just need to hang on for a little bit longer. Oh, yeah, no. That cough. I knew Should it. get out of here. You're... Hey. What's with the scary look on your face? I'm just a little tired, that's all. Master Guo Jia. Master Guo Jia. I guess you're a little too smart to fall Is for there that. online on here? Uh, unfortunately, no. No. Your supposition is correct. Like I said before, However, Dynasty Wars 9 was I ask that you please very rushed. Between us. So I, I guess they weren't able to implement two player, both two player and online mode. Is why which is see this present in Dynasty Wars 8. But not in this I game. If you could allow me to realize which is very this unfortunate. Wish. I understand. If that is your wish, Master Guo Jia. I feel like Cao Cao is going to betray Thank us. You. Uh, he, he's he's our leader. I knew that I could count on you. I don't think he could betray us specifically, but uh, hold on to that thought for later. Okay, return to Shu Cheng. That's what we're gonna have to do now. Oh, hey, look, there's Guan Yu right over there. Eh, I should probably take this time to go talk to him. In this foggy ass town. Seriously, what the hell? Oh, he's not uh Oh he's he, he's an on battle officer, not a uh, random you can find in town. Okay, never mind. Let's just ho let's just go straight to Xu Chang. Ah, this is it though. I'm pretty sure this is going to be the battle of Guandu. And after that, uh, I honestly don't remember. I mean, I think the Battle of Cherbi is takes place after Guandu, but considering Dynasty Warriors 9 has been doing uh, 
small scale battles. Like, uh, the battle of Jieting and the escape of Dong Zhuo. I honestly don't know what they're going to do next. But I'm so surprised the chapter is not yet over. Now, just as we plan, we'll slip the poison into his drink. Dong Chen? Hey, yes, it's you! That is the first step. Master Ma Tang and Master Liu Bei are ready to make their move. We all remember Dong Chen, he was present during the last this chapter. Is our chance to punish this traitor for seeking to bask in the Emperor's glory. I see you have shown your true colors at last, Dong Chen. Hey, it's LP. So he's finally getting into the story as well. But now it seems like we have a, a, yet another traitor What's on our side. This commotion? Seriously, Sao Tao has to May deal with so moment? many traitors in his lifetime. We have captured somebody who is part of a plot to have you assassinated. What? Dong Cheng? How dare you? Dum dum dum. Cao Cao, you are a servant of the Emperor, yet you ignore His Highness and act as if you rule the land yourself. You think, perhaps you think you are the Emperor, or that you will take his place. You must be punished for your boundless arrogance. I have no intention of becoming emperor. The land may require the imperial throne, but the yellow turbans and Dong Zhuo have shown that that alone is not enough. Why so much traitors? The Therefore, so many people with I their own ambitions, I guess. To this land. That, combined with the influence of the throne, will save this land. That is the path I choose to follow. I do not expect someone like you to understand. However, I cannot allow you to interfere either. Take him away. What do you have to do to be labeled as a traitor here? Going against However, your commanding Liu officer? Has already fled Xu Chong, and even gone so far as to abandon his lands in Xiao He hm. truly is a small man. Uh, siding with the enemy? Ambition. I guess. I mean, this is a different time, as you probably realize. You be, they will surely turn against you Rules were very strict the back then, as you. Must eliminate them now, while we still can. Wait, what's going on? No, we are fine to deal with them later. Liu Bei's only choice is to flee to Yuan Shao. There he will likely be used as a sacrificial pawn in a much larger game. We can deal with him when we face Yuan Shao. Even if he lives, there is Ah, no so Liu Bei fled straight to Yuan Shao. Problem for you any longer, Master Cao Cao. Yeah, because technically Yuan Shao does have the bigger army Dun, at this point. Shun Yu, there is merit to what both of you are saying. Do I chase after Liu Bei, or do I make preparations? I like how the music Yuan goes Shao. with what I he's talking about. Ah, yeah. This particular theme song is the theme of uh, the theme of Wei, I believe, which is the faction that we're playing as, and it is probably one of my favorite of the faction themes. Ah, it just fits Cao Cao and his entire army in general. Yuan Shao is using his superior numbers to his advantage. Oh, uh, finally, that fog is gone. Lines along the Yellow River have fallen, as have Bai Ma and Ian Jing. I guess we escaped Silent Hill during that, that during that cutscene. That Pu Yang has been isolated. I am also hearing word that Sun Tzu has conquered Jiangdong, 
and is planning to follow up on Yuan Shao's movements by invading Yan province. Ah, yes, Sun Tzu, the little conqueror. So, should we withdraw for the time being and look to regroup our forces? We'll find out exactly what his beef is and his no, pretty damn interesting adventures once we get into the Wei faction. Not Wei faction, the Wu faction. He conquered Jiangdong with alarming speed. As such, he has created many enemies. He will be too focused on his immediate surroundings to make a move now. Hmm. What do you think, Master Shunyo? Care to share your wisdom on the matter? Yo. If we Damn it, Shunyo, stop saying that. Defense, we will never come out ahead in this battle. Therefore, I think we should target the enemy's positions at Baima and Yanjin. Baima and Yanjing are defended by Yang Liang and Wen Chao. Although, they are some of Yuan Shao's fiercest officers, their units are woefully undermanned. We should abandon Puyang and leave the bare minimum of troops to defend our main camp. The rest of our forces will strike the enemy and create a path to victory. I have made my decision. Shunyo. We will put our destiny in your hands. Reform the units, and leave a minimal squad to defend the main camp at Guandu. Everybody else, I want you to rendezvous at Bai Ma and Yanjin. We need to secure the front lines and then eliminate Yuan Shao. We can overcome our inferior numbers through intellect and bravery. That's pretty much the only thing that's going to save us in this battle. Yeah, Yuan Shao may have the numbers, but we have the strategists in our hands. But Shao Dun is giving money to his men. Oh, that's so kind of him. Alrighty, so this is it chapter four the man who ruled the plains <clears throat> yuan shao who boasted the largest forces on the central plains begins his march southward overcome yuan shao's devastating military strength and defeat him yes so that is the main mission for this chapter well the main final mission for this chapter to defeat yuan shao at where is this exactly? I mean, I, I know it's Guandu. Oh, this entire area is essentially Guandu. So yeah. So this is the battle that we have been preparing for since the death of Dong Zhuo. We have our large army of both warriors and strategists, and we're ready to face them. So, let us see. Our first mission... Well, our first... Unlocked missions are capture of Yang Jin and capture Baima. Yeah, so these two places will become available once we capture them. Uh, but the closest mission at hand it seems to be this one. Okay, I've activated the way marker, and since it's just like literally that close, we'll go to it by horse. What about me? What about you, Scar? Oh, making you a mod? You're already a mod, Scar. Or are you? Ah, hold on a second. Yeah, you're already a mod. So stop complaining. <laughs> oh, snap. New music. Oh shit, they're attacking peasants. Defeat the bandits. Alright, we'll do. I don't know how I can ever thank you. You really did save me. You give me money. Confirm the whereabouts of the supply unit led by Ren Jin. Or Ren Jun, my bad. Okay, so where is Ren Jun? Ah, he's over there. Gotta make sure he's okay. Oh, he's being attacked by bandits. I'm here, I'm here for the rescue. Sweet. 
finally returned to my mission to strengthen the supply units. Successfully rescue Renjun. All right. Is that the mission at hand? Is that it? Yep. Seems to be it. That was pretty damn easy. Oh, there seems to be a lot of missions on the other side of the river. And on one hand, I kind of want to see what they're about, but on the other... I don't know. This, this seems to be somewhat of a two-parter. Two-parters usually have some sort of story with them so eh let's just go give him free supplies and food ah uh, if only if only well done you win an excellent display give me all my, your food and money no I'm not a tyrant well this particular character is not a tyrant oh have I climbed this watchtower yet uh, might as well make sure Yep, I climbed it. Doesn't have the uh, climb animation right there, so. Let's see. Wolf Hunt. And Infiltrate Yi. Wait, Wolf Hunt is the two parter? Complete this mission will turn the tide of war in your favor. Defeat all of the wolves. It's, okay. I don't see how that's a two parter, but let, let's do it anyway. Oh, ooh. Everyone is going to be eaten by the wolves. Please, please drive them off. I don't know, should I? All right, fine. Oh shit, these wolves are packing quite a punch. Where the fuck did they go? Where did they go? Oh, there they are. Forgive me, my fellow brethren. Forgive me. Okay, clearly you don't forgive me because you keep attacking. Not going down without a fight, I see. No, they're our family. Too bad, I'm killing them. Screw family! Come back here, you... You, you're obviously the leader of this pack. Don't run away from me! Dead. Oh, they even whined too. They whimpered. Oh, now I feel a little sad about those. I mean, yes, they were eating peasants, but oh, I still, I still feel pretty sad. Dude, your leg. What the fuck was with that leg right there? You're the savior of our village. Traitor. Take this reward. <laughs> so be it. S successfully defeated the pack of wolves. You can't see it right now, but I am definitely shedding a tear. I was fighting in this battle. Of course we won. Oh, my prize was a spirit pill. Of course. Okay, so what is the next mission at hand? Okay, this seems to be a two-parter right here so let us really it's transporting us into that location isn't there anywhere i can teleport to that's closer no oh okay what the hell is this mission be all the enemy officers and eh, it doesn't seem all that important Haitian bandits yeah, I, I, I've never actually heard of Haitian bandits before. Infiltrate Yi. Completing this mission will turn the tide of war in your favor. Obtain information you need from the peasants of Yi. Hmm. I guess that could prove useful. All right, let's. And it and it's definitely close by, so screw it. Let's do it. Oh, a bandit leader. A random bandit leader. Hey there. You guys are usually the ones that drop uh, insanely rare items. Let's see exactly what you do drop. 
100 gold. Just 100 gold? Aw, oh, come on. I face brigand pirates. Uh, brigand... Brigand captains with more money than you have. Ah, nice to see a friendly face. We fled for all we're worth from you and Zhao. Haha, <laughs> spirit and wolves. You killed your wolf you side. I have no so regrets. Things will be bad if they reach Guandu. I have a friend who runs a tavern in Yeah. He might be able to help you. Infiltrating Yi. Complete this mission with I already read this. So, yeah, I will accept. Ooh! And I get three bronze dalby. Those are uh, coins needed for crafting. Okay, that could prove extremely useful in the future. Obtain information from the tavern owner, oh, oh, the, the, the owner in Yi. Okay. Let's see what you have to say. Ah, so you've met with my friend. I've heard tales of these weapons too. A merchant is the one who told me about them. Talk to him for more details. Ah, is this gonna be one of those wild goose chase missions? Find the merchant, obtain the information you need. Okay, so where is he exactly? Is he just right there? No, he's over there. Okay, a little closer to the center of town. Eh, I, I guess we could just run straight to him. Oh no, fuck it, I want my horse. Hi ho, silver! No! Don't get caught in that stuff. Hey, what do you have to say, buddy? Hey, watch it. Keep your voice down. The weapon is real. It really is. <laughs> I'm facing the wrong direction. However, even I don't know the details. Talk to a court lady of the UN family. Ah, oh, this is a wild goose chase. Find the he handmaiden. At, at least it's all located in just this town. At least there's that. Hi ho! Uh, I need a name for you. Uh, arsenal. Your arsenal. Hi ho, arsenal. Siege weapons. Yes, they have them. I've been inside the Yuin Castle many times. You want to do something about them? I can probably help you with that. But first, I have Sounding a so fucking you. shady. I need you to find my missing cat. <laughs> uh, okay. Find the handmaiden's cat. What a weird ass mission this is. I, I didn't even know this existed in while well, I was playing through South South Story. I guess that's because I never bothered to, to Oh hey. Random brigand general in the middle of this random town. Oh I guess we're fighting. So yeah, as I was saying, I didn't even realize this mission existed when I was playing through South South Story. I guess it was because I was mostly uh, booking it straight to Guandu that I never have actually bothered to do any of these uh, other quests. I don't know. I find these quite interesting, actually. Hey, there's the cat. Wait, there's a bunch of cats. Oh no, which is the right cat? Okay, well that's a rooster. That's a boar. Another rooster, that's a human being. Hey, there's the kitty. Kitty, come back. I want to pick you up. Oh, I got the kitty. I got the invisible kitty. I put him in my pocket. No, I put the kitty in my pocket. That's so bad. Okay. Take me to my location, Arsenal. Let's go. I heard my name. Yes, you did. Yes, you definitely did. All right, here's your kitty. Fluffy darling. Your fluffy you contorted her. darling. You can leave the weapons to me. I know just who to ask to loosen a few screws. <laughs> Am I bad for helping to bring down my lord? 
Keep this a secret, please. What the f She almost seems excited to do this. But alright, I guess that means we're going to have sage weapons on our side. Or no, they're going. Uh, I think they're going to dismantle the siege weapons on Yuash Yuan Shao's side. So I guess that helped. Uh, all right then. I think we spend way too much time dealing with the north uh, side of the river. So let's head back to east, back to uh, south, and deal with these two important missions: capture Yanjin and capture Baima. Can I not teleport? Fast travel. Yeah, I'm trying to fast travel. Oh, I can only fast travel to Baima. And eh, these should be fairly. This should be. These should be done fairly quickly. Let's see. How far am I? Ah, uh, not pretty far. Not. Not actually. Not that far. Sao Sao Weaklings. Teeny weeny Sao Sao babies. Ah, there's our siege buttons. Our sage towers, actually. Oh, I guess that could be classified as a sage weapon right there. I always call it a ballista. What even is a ballista, anyway? I think it's supposed to be those, uh... Weird, uh, sort of cannon like arrow things that are usually shown in other Dynasty Wars games. I don't really know how to describe it. It's like a sort of fantastical weapon. Well, no, not as fantastical as the fucking Juggernauts or the Wood Oxens. But I actually give the Wood, Ox Wood Oxens and Juggernauts a pass because. <laughs> They're kind of what make Yue Ying so fucking badass. Which reminds me, I wonder what the Juggernauts look like in this game. Oh, that's gonna be exciting. There we go. Alright, let's retake the town. Yes, yes, I know I can just climb the ladders, but... <laughs> climb the ladders the normal way, but I like using my grappling hook on there. Just to show off. Just to show off. I'm literally a walking fire warrior right now. And it's ironic because I'm not playing as the Wu. I'm not playing as the Wu at this moment. I'm playing as the Wei, who is known for their ice elemental warriors at the time. I'm the Juggernaut bitch. <laughs> Why? Yes, yeah, she is the Juggernaut bitch. <laughs> oh God damn it! I never actually realized that she literally is the juggernaut bitch. I am truly impressed by your skill. That's what I'm gonna call her from now on. Oh, okay, so our next mission is capture Yang Jing. Oh, we have no fast travel options. Fuck it, guess we're just gonna have to ride there. Uh, going in the completely wrong direction. There we go. You win. You are a true warrior of the three kingdoms. Yeah. Wait, how many kills do I have now? Does it actually tell me in the main menu? Ah, oh, I don't think it tells me. All right. Random soldier, let me kill you so I can see how much kill, how much my kill count is. Two thousand and thirty. God damn. It must have counted throughout the entire chapter. Which now that I think about it, isn't that much of a kill count. Uh, it's probably because I've been skipping a lot of missions throughout the last few ones. Oh, who's that? Another brigand captain.
Who's level 22? Wait, is he level 22? Oh, he's level 27. Okay, I think I can deal with him. Even though they're playing like the super badass. Oh my god, we're about to die music. Fuck it, this is actually getting... <laughs> this is actually making me pretty tense. Smooth so. Seriously, dude, you must be pretty badass to have this theme song. <laughs> Although I clearly didn't see it. Ooh, he gave me, uh, the merit of the Suma? I think that's a item you can, uh, sell at the shops. And I think I also got a gold Diabe as well. Sweet. What did that guy give me? A gold Yip Chian. Ah, sweet. Okay, I guess it was pretty worth. I guess it was uh, worth actually fighting these guys. Level thirty-four. It's, uh, it's, fuck it, I'm fighting these guys. I want to get more coins. And also an excuse just to hear this song again. Seriously, this is like Nobunaga levels of badass. Okay, and then the guitars kick in. Like, by Nobunaga, I meant like the choir at the beginning, just randomly spouting. Jeez, these guys have a lot of defense to them. Okay, maybe it's best if I actually use my strength pills. Just to make things go by quicker. Ah, there we go. That was a level 28 guy, right? Yeah. Wait, where's, where's the other captain at? Wait, where'd the other captain go? Oh, there he is. Damn it, I lost track of him. I was too busy swiveling and swerving all over the place. And I ended up going too far. Uh, seriously, where's the climactic music at? Okay, there it is. Love that song. Damn, those strength pills make all the difference. Alright, now that I've finished horsing around, let's just go straight to the next mission. Arsenal seriously stops swerving around all over the place. You make me look like a drunk. Oh fuck, these guys are actually trying to fight back! Snap! <laughs> what the hell? What are you doing with those weapons? I'm stopping you right here! Archers! Stop them! No matter the cost! Oh damn it, are they gonna rain arrows at us? Well too bad because I'm already reading arrows on their soldiers. Ah, yep. Yang Liang. Back, what I miss? Ah, uh, not that much. Well, it depends. How long were you gone? Whoop. Ah, oh shit, they really throws down at us. 
Unfortunate for them, though, it's, there's not really much of a problem. Heck, it's not even an annoyance. It's just, oh, hey, look, there's an arrow. And it just went past me. Oh, that's nice. So where's the commander at? <laughs> I really went show. You could have thought of a better plan than this. And now you end up burning to death. Well done, you win. An excellent display. <laughs> that was pretty badass. Uh, we have no choice. We have to abandon Yang Jin. <laughs> How powerless I feel. Like five minutes gone. Oh, then really nothing at all. I was fighting in this battle. Oh, well, I was technically fighting an, a super epic uh, brigand leader who had this really awesome rocking music to him, even though he was clearly, like, nothing. So, all in all, you miss absolutely nothing important. Alright, so that's the capture mission was done. Capture Wu Chao. Oh, this just unlocked. Completing this mission will decrease the morale of the enemy. Defeat Chun Yu Xiong. A weird name. Uh, so let's see. Yeah, their morale is still pretty high. So why don't we just head straight to this mission then? Xiao's man Shu Yu wishes to surrender. He awaits word in Wu Chao. Shu Yu. <laughs> For a second there, I thought they said Shun Yu. Uh, I'll be like, oh my god, he betrayed us? I knew I couldn't trust that voice. Ooh, discovered a licorice root? Wait, what? Oh, I discovered a new material spot. I might as well show this off as well. Where exactly is the spot at? It's a spot. No, it's, it's a little left to the map. But there we go. Yeah, so you can find uh, random spots on the map that have this little icon right here. Uh, it basically it indicates there's a bunch of random materials that you can collect around here. I'm watching you wolves. Level 28 wolves. Oh, you better not get too close to me. Oh, fuck, they're, they're, they're running. They're booking it. They're booking it. Gotta go. Okay, yeah, so let's... Uh, where's the mission at? Ah, it's down there. Set the way marker. Because cause now I have no idea where I was going. Don't attack them. Too late. Okay, so this is the mission, right? What exactly are we supposed to do here? Capture Wu Chao. Oh, we're supposed to get, head to Wu Chao. Wait, do we need to talk to somebody here? Oh, there he is. There's Shun Yo. Well, Shu Yo. My bad. Oh, you have trusted my words and come to see me. The advantage lies with Master Cao Tao. I will surrender. Smart man, smart man. I bring with me a gift. I will tell you the weakness in UN Chao's It's army. candy. Here in Wu Chao, it's a large scale storehouse. As you know, provisions are vital for any army. With a storehouse to burn, for example, that would be a major blow. Well, can't we take some of the supplies for ourselves first? Uh, nope. Can't leave any witnesses, I guess. Hey, look, random wolves. Night, how nice. Yeah, so nice. Oh, they really do whimper when I kill them. That's so sad. Oh. The enemy is going to attack us here. Everyone, prepare to defend this spot. All right, let's go burn those. What the fuck is happening here? What? What the? What was with that sudden burst of light? W was there thunder or something? And why did it suddenly turn dark? Oh, that was weird. Do not let army near the units. Prepare to fire. 
It's Zhong He! Mr. Fabulous himself. Mr. Oh, he doesn't even have his claws in this game. No, what happened to what happened to my baby boy in his claws? It will be difficult for them to maintain such a large army. We must quickly defeat the enemy officer and start the fire. Oh man, they took out one of the best weapons in the game, didn't they? Uh, that's unfortunate. That is really fucking unfortunate. Ah well. At least he still sounds super fabulous. Well, not as fabulous as he used to. Ah well. Oh, and I noticed that he's also wearing a yellow attire in this battle. That's a nice little attention to detail there, since he's uh, serving you want you want Shao at this point, so he would wear yellow. Uh, can I can I get him insta kill? Can I get please? Can I get can I get the insta kill working? My beauty dictates that I cannot be killed that easily. Oh shit! You killed me. <laughs> oh, we even obtained a gem from him. Cross gem, ah, clearly you're so right. sweet. I need everyone to defend this area. <laughs> My eyes. <laughs> yeah, what the fuck was that? Be gone. Shall won't be whole. Our supplies will soon be Wow, as soon as he died, everything just turned into fire. Hmm, yes. Ah, and we have Zhang Fei defecting to our side now. So yeah, Zhang Fei is now a warrior of Wu. Or not Wu. Why do I keep saying Wu? He's now warrior Wei on our side. And I wholeheartedly accept him. Anyone as fabulous as him would definitely be welcome in our army. Of course we won. Spectacular. Your bravery is alluring. <laughs> All right, I'm glad I did that mission because I actually got to meet Zhang He that time. All right, so. Seems like there are really only just two mission, two main missions left. One of them is kind of important. The other is unknown. But do we really need to do that one? I don't think so. So, in that case, I think it's finally time to head to Guangdu and face Yuan Shao himself, along with Genji there too. And we actually get to meet Genji as well. Now I'm act now I'm super excited. Let's go capture one of those unsightly positions. Follow me. Get out of the bamboo forest. Get out of it. Okay, thank you. I'm having fun with this stream. When are you going to end it? Huh, that's a good question. When am I gonna end it? Well I guess I could end it once All we right. finish this chapter. I need everyone to defend this area. Oh snap. It's Guandu time. Oh shit, I just realized, look at how how large our force is at this, at, look how large our force is at this point. We have so many playable officers on our side, <laughs> Yuan Shao only has one. And then she's going to defect on our side <laughs> just in a few, in a matter of minutes. It is time. The enemy area is ours for the taking. Ah, uh, Lady Jen, you make me so wet. I mean, what? <laughs> Defense captain is heading over to the escort friendly force. Really? Alright. Oh shit! 
Did our morale just drop completely? Well, we have the bigger force than him. What, what? Well, I guess that's technically not historically accurate. <laughs> okay, so they're heading to our main camp. That means we're gonna have to stop them before they make it. And our main camp is right here. Oh shit, and Genji's already booking it straight to the main camp. Okay, we better stop her. Where the fuck is she? Oh, she's right here. There she is. Little Lady Jen. You may not have your flute in this game, but the whip actually isn't bad on you. You may not be as broken as, like, Dynasty Warriors 7, but you're still awesome. Ah, and there's... There's the result of that earlier mission. So yeah, we did destroy his siege weapons. That makes things a lot more easier now. Forgive me, Lady Chen. Oh, I got, I got a, I got a gem, but I accidentally skipped it. Wait, wait, wait. What, what was that gem again? All right, I actually want to know what this is. Uh, let's see. All the way down. Slash Lord Gem. Oh, it's another Lord Gem. Let's see. Strength plus thirteen. Attack speed plus four. Defense plus forty-seven with elemental. May drop yeast when attack hits. Yeast is, I believe, a healing item, so that could actually prove to be extremely useful. Hmm. Strength plus 12. Strength plus 13. Okay, I'm switching that Scourge gem for the Slash Lord gem. Alright. Man, these Lord gems are pretty damn useful. Okay, those must be, uh... Wait. What? Zoltov plans to reinforce his supply lines in preparation for a long battle. We cannot allow him to do that. Attack the enemy supply troops! Wait, where's our supply troops at? Our shells are after the supply units. All the way up there? Oh, there's Eugene and Li Dian. Yuan Shao asks reinforcements to be sent to the connecting bases. Oh wow, I just realized there are a bunch of officers in our main camp already. Okay, we better head down there fast. <laughs> Man, I love this voice. Probably one of the best voices in this game, in my opinion. He wants shout. Damn, these normal soldiers are actually attacking. I'm actually pretty surprised by that. Wait. Oh, the officers are all up there. And I just realized there's a lot of siege towers on that side of the map. Oh no, this isn't good. What? Why would Cao Cao do such a thing to Wu Chao? So it was him about the storehouse is there. Ah yes, and there's the information about the storehouse right there. Supply depot and Wu is on fire. The morale of Yuan Shao's forces has plummeted. That takes Sweet. Care of the preparations. Now, we can move to the offensive. Can we actually destroy these? I'm a little scared by them. What's the health that? Ah, the supply unit has arrived. Doesn't look like it has any health bar. Rejoice, 
Okay, keep going. You're doing good, sir. I know, right? Like one second our morality was completely dipped, and the next minute it's just it's already halfway. Okay, so we can destroy these siege towers, but they don't look like they're moving. Can I just ignore these? Yeah, I'm pretty. I'm just gonna ignore these and head straight to the main camp because our main camp is being attacked. Oh shit! They managed to get in. I didn't even realize that. Our target has been determined. Capturing that area. Hey, where was it? Was it just me, or was there no sound for a second there? Like no uh, weapon sounds that for some reason. That was pretty weird. Okay, they seem to be attacking Josh Shu up there. Alright, let's go save him. We may not trust you all too much right now, but you're still an ally, so we kind of do have to save you. Wait, where's the, where's the main officer at? Oh, there he is. Gao Gan. Join forces to take on the enemy. Get him. Yeah. Will 2 is headed to escort the friendly forces. Wait, I didn't know I didn't get to read that completely. Ah, whatever. Doesn't really matter. Oh shit, there's a bunch of officers on this side of the map. Probably means using a Musa would be a good idea. What the f- Why was it locking onto everyone? Doesn't matter. These guys are chow food already. Sure, Scar, sure. We'll do that after this. Oh man, these guys are getting their asses kicked. This is all just too easy for me, I, I guess. Alright, that takes care of most of the officers around here. There's a hammer captain on that side, but I... He, he probably won't do that much damage to us. Oh wow, and Genji... Wait, that's... That's Manchong. Oh wait, that's Sao Pi. Oh, I thought I I, I could have sworn I saw Genji right right here. Guess not. Alright. Let's go deal with this random officer on the side. Let's go. Now is the time to attack. Then B. You're all alone here, dude. You're not gonna last the night. What? Did I already get 3,000 kills already? Oh, damn. I guess it's because I'm actually fighting all the random soldiers in Guangdu. Shen Pei. Yeah, I never heard of you before, so you're probably gonna die here. You should call that the Muso Lock On Special Attack. For, yeah, I would if I figured out exactly what happened there. And if I could replicate it. Hmm, maybe I was pressing the Lock On button too much or something. Actually, I should probably test it. Oh, that. Okay, I think I was just, I think I was pressing the lock on button too much. But still, that was a pretty cool, like, thing I did. Oh. That was a mistake from my part. Now is the time to attack! 
Boom. Okay, that's most of the officers in our way. And we're already at Guan and we're already at Yuan Shao's castle. I guess that's it. I turn after reviewing my strategy. And now you won't. Well done, Yuan. An excellent display. Let's go. Now is the time to attack. Alrighty, let's book it. Guo two. About time we got moving. I think Ha, <laughs> another Guo, I just realized that. Another unimportant figure, at least from my opinion. Alright, where do we go to now? Oh, I guess I went the wrong direction. Bengji! Killed like it was nothing. Really impressed by your skill. So you on Shao. Your sons are all defeated. Your daughter-in-law has been taken hostage. Your best warrior's done for. What are you gonna? Well, apparently you're going to ambush me. All right, you want to go down hard? Let's do it. Uso attack, sucker! Might as well just do an aerial Muso. Cause it looks so fucking badass. Just shooting random aerial ar arrows in every single direction. And that's it! There goes well Yuan Shao. An excellent display. Capturing the we did it! Faces is the key. We've taken over the northern side of the of China. At least. Yeah, we did. We did it! Time we got moving. I think securing that area will prove beneficial to our cause. Can I head in the chair? Can I sit in the chair? I want to sit in the chair. Oh, there's no chair. There's a table. Overcome our noble army. No, this is impossible. I refuse to believe it. With this, the master has secured all of Hebei. Everyone. Give a victory cry! Woohoo! This victory has opened a path forward for our lord. My only regret is that I will not live to see where it leads. Gojia, no! Yeah, it's confirmed that he's basically going to die. But we did it! Yeah, we did it! Lord Sao Woo! No, that's the person we have to fight next. <laughs> this victory alone is not enough to end the chaos. We must seek out and punish all who oppose us. Eugene, stop being a party pooper. Easy, Eugene. We have defeated our greatest enemy in Yuan Shao. Allow the men to rest and celebrate for at least a day. Yes, my lord. As you command. At least just one day. Then you can go back to punishing them later. Everybody, listen up. We have defeated Yuan Shao to become the single largest force in the land. We are ready to begin our quest to unite the land. However, the fight to come will be nothing like we've ever seen before. Hard and fraught with peril. Yeah, this is only the beginning. That is of no concern to us now. 
Tonight, we will celebrate our victory in order to refresh both our minds and bodies. We're gonna party hard and get drunk while doing it. Just you wait, Yuan Shao. The path I have laid. The battles yet to come. It was all a part of my I grand ambition. I bring an end to the chaos with my own hands and create a new world order for all to enjoy. Really? Only the beginning? Well, yeah. We haven't even gotten into the Three Kingdoms War yet. Like, this is... <laughs> In the grand scheme of things, this is really just only the prologue. Surprising, I know. <laughs> and heck, we won't even see the entire story in the Way campaign. As most of the warriors won't be alive to see the end. Master oh, and we have a that's in with these two. Wandu was spectacular. Your exploitation of you and Chow's weakness and that. Ah, there's the wine, but where's the women? Where's the My women at? Contribution was nothing compared to your own master Guojia. I can only dream of my hair being as shiny as yours. It just so happened that I was the one the enemy leaked that information to. After that, I just used the information to give our lord the very best plan I could think of. You don't allow yourself enough credit, but I guess I should have expected. Oh, where's the men everywhere? I, standing in harem for all, harem for everyone. And detailing a battle is just not me. I have no problems with just acting well. I just can't be like you or Master Yu. Or be like Master Jia Shu. Hey. Oh. <laughs> booga booga. I hear you saying my <laughs> that name. Fucking scared face. You, Master Shun Wu. It looks like you talk a lot when you drink. Master Jia Shu. <laughs> Sorry for butting in. I guess I can go do my thing somewhere else. I guess I didn't hear. I guess I heard that I was needed. No, all right, I'll just be on my way. And then he prances around. He prances away from the scene. Is truly exceptional. Is drunk. Oh my God, this is good wine. That does put me in a difficult position. I had planned to have you take over for me one day, Master Gojia. No, it's not. Why does everybody say it's nothing when they're about to die? That and anyway, they always say that. I couldn't ask for a better friend than you. Yes, I will stay with you as long as you need me. You like the blonde? Yeah, you like Guojia? Heck, who doesn't like Guojia? It's too bad that basically after this battle, he, well, dies. If it's not obvious enough, this is when he dies. D. Wait, why wasn't I invited to the party? <laughs> and that's the end of the chapter, I guess. Alright, so what do we have next? I'm thinking it's the Battle of Chirpy, but I, I honestly don't the remember. The forces of Cao Cao defeat the armies of Yuan Shao at Guandu. The Yuan family loses momentum and eventually is wiped out. Cao Cao is now the closest to... Oh, we didn't even get to do that mission where we land. chase his sons? Elsewhere, All right. Sun Quan has inherited control in Jingdong following the death of his brother, Sun Se. Spoiler narrator, that's His a spoiler. <laughs> cannot compare to that of Cao Cao. Liu Bei has yet to find a land and is currently taking refuge with Liu Biao in Jing. Aww, he is homeless Bei Bei Bei. To govern, but he has practically no force of arms. 
This is truly the age. That makes Baby very sad. The age of Cow Cow. Truly a luxurious age. <laughs> no, he better not. Sorry to disappoint you, Scar, but he's dead. Especially if this is this battle, Chirby. Because if it is Chirby, then yeah, he basically really is dead. Even though we've taken out Yuan Chao, there sure are a lot of enemies left out there. Yes, we have Zhang Lu and Ma Tang to the west, and Liu Biao Ugh, and Sun Ma Chuan Tang. to the south. I have a lot to say Wei about Kong that bastard. Is in of our defenses in the west, but he will be unable to hold out for long if Ma Tang makes his move. At present, Master Cao Ren is defending our southern border. I propose we turn our attention to the west. I agree. Liu Biao doesn't stand much of a chance against Cao Ren. My lord, we should move against Ma Teng in the west. My so, lord. So this isn't the battle, Chirby. Cao Ren, we were just talking about you. What is the matter? Oh, I think I know what this mission is. Sorry, but I have failed you. Liu Bao's army. The Eight Gates Formation. Through the Eight Gates Formation. Yeah, this is definitely to Castle from dealing with uh, Zhu Xu. Not to be confused Liu with Chu Chu. Chu Chu. But his tactics were unlike anything I've ever seen. Curse these similar sounding names. We have to have reinforcements. What? Liu Bei was able to overcome the Eight Gates formation? Master Cao Ren's Eight Gates formation is not something that can easily be defeated by a simpleton such as Liu Bei. And yet it was. That can only mean... My lord, we must assume that Liu Bei has gained the services of a rather capable strategist. Given this new development, we should place our move west on hold for now. <laughs> wow, Shun Yu, don't Seems sound Liu so Bei disappointed. Has quite the thorn in my side. We must hurry to Wen Castle and so slay should have killed Liu Bei him when you had the chance. But no, nobody listens to Shao Yuan. Sneezes. Oh, Scar, are you sick at the moment? Oh, that's so sad. We've received reports that Liu Bei's army is taking up position from Fan Castle all the way to Zhang Ling. Additionally, there doesn't appear to be anybody who looks like a strategist among his ranks. <laughs> then maybe their strategist doesn't look like a strategist. He could be mixed in with the troops, like Master Shun Yo is. Uh, yeah, I'll admit. He does kind of look a little scruffy. It's hard to think someone would turn their back on Master Cao Cao to serve Liu Bei instead. He must be rather naive. I agree with that as well. Oh, perhaps that naivete is the key to our success. If we can find out more about this strategist, we can use his weaknesses to our advantage. Maybe so. But first, we need to repel Liu Bei's attack on Wen Castle. I'll take care of that. Very well. However, there are likely to be others who have joined Liu Bei's cause besides this strategist. Be sure to keep a wary eye on Guan Yu and his other officers. Yes, my lord. Hunt down Liu Bei's army. I want the strategist that is advising him. It seems they have prepared a strategy for dealing with us. It must be due to this new strategist of his. 
Approach with caution. All right, so this is chapter five. We, well, I guess this is the perfect time to actually end the stream now because we've been going on for quite a while. And yeah, we've already, we've now completed chapter four. I gotta say that was a pretty long one. Like literally four main missions in one and then there was the Battle of Guandu, which took quite a while. But now we're in chapter five and we have, now we're dealing with Liu Bei. Uh, once and for all. Well, now we're dealing with uh, more of the Three Kingdom events. Which basically means we're going to face Liu Bei and even Sun Quan in the south a lot more than usual. So this is technically a new... Uh, this is technically a new era in the game. Ugh, it's only gonna take a while. I realize we just finished Guandu. <sighs> but anyway, time will tell. I we we definitely have a lot of time to go through most of these stories. But for now, this is where we end it here. So wanna thank you all for joining me in this stream. This has been Spirit Rose Spirit Rosewolf, and I'll be signing out. Later!